meet Lucy, Lily and Onky Sandwich. They live at Oasis Farm Waterloo, along with two sheep, a brood of hens and guinea pigs named after the Spice Girls. Hiding in here, we have ginger spice. The livestock thrive next to a verdant veggie garden. Nice, lots of tomatoes. Yeah, they've done really well this year, actually. The land has been given rent-free to charities Oasis and Jamie's Farm, based in Wiltshire. The kids from the local area go and do a week's course up there and then come and do like a top-up thing with six weeks with us where they work with us and they make food and they help us with the compost and they help garden and they help with the animals. They're children who are at risk of exclusion, they might have low self-esteem, they might have gone through a personal trauma and the transformation has been phenomenal. Reduced exclusions, um, reduced uh, negative behaviour, they've really, really improved on how they've seen themselves. The other beneficiary of this peaceful place is an architect firm which built its studio here. It gives really nice um, respite for um, our team to, if they're having a stressful day, to come outside, to uh, go and feed the animals or do a bit of weeding or gardening. And uh, as you've seen, we have meetings outside as well and eat lunch together out here. It's not just the squeal of train wheels that interrupt meetings. They have been known to interrupt a few Skype calls in the past. They're quite noisy when they get fed at the end of the day. Field and Fowl's architects recently added another award-winning building, the barn. So this is the um, education space really and the kind of community facing side of the whole farm site. Um, so the front door to the site is at this end, there's a classroom space and a big community space for children to do group activities and learn all year round. But they're on a meanwhile use lease. They know they'll be here until at least August next year. So all this has been constructed to be easily disassembled and moved one day to another scrap of land.